What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Car Mechanic 2014. It's your mechanic, Beastie Boy Drummer. Let's go with our third invoice, our third order. And as you can see on the description here, the faster I drive, the louder this horrible noise gets. Oh boy, what's going on? I also noticed that the dashboard lights are getting dimmer. Now I'm thinking that that might be that the battery is dying or either the alternator is going bad, but the faster I drive, the louder this horrible noise gets. I don't know about that, but we gotta find and eliminate the cause. They gave us $550. Cool, cool. So, it's probably gonna be something within the, the running gear down here. So, let's go ahead and test drive this thing, man. See if we can find out some random stuff. I never noticed that before, but has that always been in little, like, floaty particles? What's going on? I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but you should be able to. A little, like, little dust fragments or something. Let's go ahead and test this car out, do a couple donuts with it. <laughs> Might have to change my music. I don't know if y'all heard it or not, but I had to readjust my headphones there. Let's go ahead. Seems like I kind of heard a noise, like I actually... Oh, wow! <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta get my driving skills up. They're horrible. It seems like I can hear the noise like whenever uh, it's about to change the gear or something like whoa that sounded rough. I think uh, I, I used to think like um, in this game that it wouldn't actually like when you test drive you wouldn't actually be able to hear whatever the people was talking about or you just had to wait and see if you could find whenever you started inspecting the car but I think you can actually like hear so whatever they say is wrong with it. Sounds horrible when it breaks. Whoa! Watch it. Watch when I break it. No, I didn't do it that time. Oh, I think it was when I put it in reverse. Yeah, listen to that. That don't sound good at all. I didn't do. I didn't do. All right, let's go ahead and see what we can find. See if we can find something wrong with this vehicle. If not, I don't know. Send it to another mechanic. But we got this. We're like, we're like, what? This is our 18th order, right? So we're what, like 17 and 0 right now? <laughs> Let's go. This is easy. This is what we do. First up, I want to, uh, I wonder if I can do the, uh, the chip thing in here. Since the dashboard likes to get dim, like this, um, OBD link. Now, I should be charging them, like, Five hundred dollars just for me hooking this up to their car. For real. Mm-hmm. Checking errors. Any errors? Anywhere? Anywhere? Finalizing. I might have to figure out what that does. Oh no. I haven't figured it out yet. But anyway, let's go ahead and uh, pop this hood first. Let's see what's going on under the hood here. Now, I'm pretty sure I think the battery the battery looks good what about alternator alternators good on yup that's what it is the alternator is done figure that's what it was when the lights was getting dim all right we replace that here on a second let's go ahead and see if we can hide the body and show uh see if we can see what's going on anything looks horribly bad bad in here I don't really see nothing right off hand, so we may have to get in there. And it can't be the tires, because the tires are good. But the louder it gets, the faster it gets, the louder the horrible noise gets. So it's got to be something rolling, so something inside of the tire, I'm thinking. we get back to that later, let's go ahead and see if we can repair this alternator. Yep, sure can. I figure you can repair alternator. Go ahead, put this back in here. Replace the alternator real quick. Get this out the way. Um, I, I took some else. Oh yeah, I took that belt off. Yeah, let's put that, put that back. They may need that. All right, 
Now we're gonna have to take a tire off so I can see what's going on inside of here. Yeah, I like that. We're getting fire, so I can't wait to get that upgraded all the way up. And I'm thinking like it's some inside of here that's kinda kinda horrible. Turn our conditions on here. I wanted these brake pads. Now the brake pads look good, actually. They look greenish. Look at this. Now I can't figure out. They say the faster they go, the louder the horrible noise gets. This may be some actually under the car, so. Let's go ahead and see if we can do some expecting down there. I done took a tire off and <laughs> these some other stuff. Be alright. See if we can examine this. That looks good. What's this? That's good. Everything else seems to be great. Um, this is the rubbing something. That's good. Alright, let's check this while I'm at it. Seems pretty nice and tidy on here. From what I can see, anyway. Do something real quick. Uh, we gotta do some more random stuff. And uh, as I was saying in the previous um, video, the previous orders, I was, I was wondering when the, the mission was gonna start getting harder. And they, they're getting a little bit harder now. Cause I don't know what I'm looking for. Let's go ahead and I'm just gonna take this whole thing off here. See if I can find some inside one of these tires. Cause it might actually be like this, uh, this whole piece right here. Take out this break, this. And this is what I want to look at here. See if this right here is bad. I don't know. I don't know if it is. I don't know if I could replace it or not. But oh, dang it! Wrong button. Wrong button. That's what I want to press. I want to examine this. They won't even let me examine it. I don't think I can take this off. Way bar, um, what else could it be? It would have to be some which is like maybe riding. It may be something actually in the hood. I mean, uh, actually in the engine. Never know. Let's inspect in here, see what we got going on. Examination mode. Just Oh, this stuff looks great. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Check some of this stuff out over here, see what we got. Alright, all that stuff, the timing is good. Um,. It would have to be something. Have to be something within uh, the drive train. Yes, it would have to be. Knew it would. Everything else looks great. Battery still in good condition. This right here is good. Um. Um. Something I can think of. It's a way bar. Fast hold. Let me check this uh, list again. Oh, finally eliminated the goals. I think I did it. 
Was I just looking around for nothing? The faster I drive, the louder this horrible noise gets. I didn't think Austin would make a noise, but okay. Put your tie back on then. <laughs> Maybe I need to start checking. I was, Cause I had been finished that. Let me pick this stuff back up here. I'm over here doing all extra kind of stuff. I'm over here trying to trying to fix stuff. Don't even need fix, man. Go look at that. I'm I'm like a beast mechanic right now. I'm in my zone. Get this time I go. Get this car out of my garage. So I can give me an upgrade again. All right, I think I think they're done. Yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> Next order, let's go. So the only thing I had to do for that order was replace the alternator. I mean, I, I could tell that from the, the get-go when they said the, the lights were getting dim in the dashboard. That's a sign of alternator. So let's go ahead and move on to the next mission. Next order. What do we have here? Find a solution. I can barely afford a car, but I've managed to buy myself one. It doesn't start, though. Help me, please. I only have $300 left, and... I need it working before I can show it to my parents. Okay, I got you, buddy. This sounds like a teenager first car. About the first thing he's seen. Usually, this is this is like a, a teenager guy's car because females they don't go out and buy anything. They will probably their first car be like something their parents would buy for them. So let's check out the hood. See what we got here. Nothing is inspected. I'm see uh. As you can see right here, the only thing that is showing um, is this cap right here and efforts in this right here. So I'm gonna check the um, this um, this unit in here, see if that actually does something. Like this old OBD link. Now I'm thinking whenever this does it, it's gonna like we examine some parts for me that I won't have to check out let's check it out and see yes oh that was the alternator okay cool oh yeah but uh, your ignition wires are shot and your ignition module may work So let's go let's go ahead and get these right here off. I'm trying to get these uh Okay, first I gotta take this off, cool. I got it. So ignition wise first and let's see if we can go down here and find out problem with anything. The alternator may be good, I mean it's a crappy car, but if we can get them ignition ignition wires to work then we may be good. Another thing I want to do is um, examine some stuff. So I found out how to check the alternator and stuff like that now. Which is cool. Learn something new every day. <clears throat> A lot of this stuff is horrible. Like, serious? Let's check the starter back here. Okay, starter has already been checked too. The only thing we may need is the ignition wires. Let's see if we can repair those ourselves first. Cause he ain't got them three hundred dollars. Dang it! Uh, we'll go back. Got some new ignition wire. Still gonna use car parts. <laughs> Do they say ignition wires in here? I think this is like stuff you make and rebuild. I think that's what they sell in here. Probably. No, nope, they say ignition wires. I'm about to buy. Them. Yep. Yeah, my ignition wires work a little bit better. <laughs> the car may start now. But he may be in there. Ugh. I'm better for the car. Dang it. I think I might have just bought those for nothing. I'm probably going to have to. 
Probably have to buy some brand new ones, ignition wires. But everything else seems to be in in good condition. Well, in good enough working condition, as I must say. So I just bought those for nothing. Waste a little, waste a little money right there. How much I waste? Oh, they sold out. But I think I waste like sixty dollars or something like that. Brand new ones. It's gonna cost me hundred fifty dollars. God, God, this guy's lucky. Look, I'm trying to look out for him. He probably got a girlfriend. He trying to go see and stuff. He can't get in trouble by his parents for buying a broke down car. I look out for him though this time. Yeah, uh, still won't start. He got him three hundred dollars now. I can't replace nothing else. Let me see something right quick. Is it something I'm missing that I take anything extra off? Should check and see if the car got oil. Open this up real quick. I'm gonna check out this oil filter, see what it's like. Oil filter's good. Now this stuff wouldn't cause the car not to start, but. Another thing that would cause a car not to start, and the only reason I know is because of experience. Let me see. Um, symbol. Let's pick this back up here. Battery's good. Okay. I'm gonna go to the next thing that I know of myself. Let's go ahead and uh, get it done. Cause this happened to me one time before. Let's check it out on here real quick. Now these right here would cause your car not to start uh, if your fuel pump is bad, which that one is good, and this is unknown. Examine. That's pretty good too, man. Do he got any gas in the car? He probably ain't got no gas. What do you think? Fruit tank. Don't know. Kind of lost for words. It will have to be something. Then the engine. Let me check this. Uh, time and again over here. Make sure everything looks copacetic. Drop it down first. Drop it like it's hot. Wow, this 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 one's kind of tough right here. Give me this broke down car to work with, dude. Check, make sure he do got an air filter in here. Hold on. I'm pretty sure if stuff is like round. 30 to 40 it still will work because there's a lot of stuff like 30 to 40 up here and I'm not replacing all that stuff for them. I'm just I'm just gonna replace anything that I see in the red majorly in the red so I got this condition here what we got what we got it's 35 that's pretty good what can I take out this condition I think I would have to actually drive to check that out. Dipstick, what kind of condition are you in? I don't know. Just trying to check everything out that I can now. Uh, is he missing something? No. Got this, that, 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 that. Yes, everything looks. I can't figure it out, dude. So, what's your car? 
the new starter's in decent condition. Ignition module is pretty cool, pretty cool. It's not that bad. It wasn't dead like the ignition wireless was. Let's see if we can do something real quick. I'm gonna uh, try to replace some stuff. Then I'm going to see if I can test drive the car. If the car isn't still running, I shouldn't be able to test drive it. You would think so anyway. Man, I know this is going to be like a uh, long episode here. Because it is. This, this piece of crap right here is taking forever. This broke down car. I bet you somebody out there that's watching this is actually like almost a mechanic. They, they probably know exactly what it is. Like, bro, it's right there in front of your face. Um. Can we test it? This is not like to perform test drive. Wow. Broke down car. Can't test drive, so I can't see what's more stuff that's wrong with it. Let me try lifting it up again. I'm gonna make sure they do have everything under here. Everything is. Yeah, the whole exist exhaust system is good. Check right here, see what we got. But I'm thinking, I know, I may know what I have to do because it's inside the engine, so. Uh, I may have to do some stuff I want to do. Spend extra money because this guy ain't giving me nothing but $300 to get this mess fixed. I'm, I'm about to call up a real mechanic. I'm like, hey, fix this car, dude. <laughs> I gave you $250. Take it or leave it. I already picked new ignition wires on it, so you ain't got to do too much. Maybe I should put some oil in I don't know if I should put oil in it or not. I don't want to be like wasting my oh snap let me take that off. Everything this condition seems to be alright to me. 40 stuff, 40, 40, 40. Alternate is 45, so that oh that seems pretty good to me. Can we examine this? See how much oil is in it. Oh Keep it all between max and minimum marks. New oil has a golden color. While wow, old is black. Okay. Well, this looks pretty good. But, yes, it needs some oil. That's what was wrong with it. I should have did this when I was replacing oil in people's cars. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, right, you got this. I got this. I think I, I, think I know what to do now. I think we just need some oil. Good. Drink it. Oh, and how can you know how much oil to put in there? Maybe when it start getting bubbly like that. Let's check this uh, dipstick down here again. Ooh, a little bit too much, but I think it's cool. Dude, your car is running. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it now. Pretty sure. I don't think I took nothing else off of it. I put some oil in it. Um, I do want to get inside here and see what's going on. I might as well. <sighs> Why not? But then I got to take tires off. Oh. Alright everybody, I'm going to hit the end of this video. Next video we're going to find out what is going on with this car. Because it's getting on my nerves. Alright everybody, this has been your Mechanic Beast Boy Jungle. We'll finish this car up on the next episode. Gone.